Hey everyone, and welcome to Advanced AI, Deep Reinforcement Learning in PyTorch. This is the best and most in-depth online resource for learning one of the most powerful forms of AI, Deep Reinforcement Learning. So who am I and why should you listen to me? Well, my name is The Lazy Programmer, and I'm the author of over 30 online courses in data science, machine learning, and financial analysis. I have two master's degrees in engineering and statistics. My career in this field spans over 15 years. I've worked in multiple companies that we now call big tech and multiple startups. Using data science, I've increased revenues by millions of dollars with the teams I've led. But most importantly, I am very passionate about bringing this pivotal technology to you. Okay, so what is this course all about? Well, as the title suggests, this course is all about deep reinforcement learning, which combines the field of reinforcement learning with deep neural networks. Traditionally, these have been separate topics, but in recent years, Researchers have discovered new techniques that make them effective when used together, and the benefits go in both directions. Deep learning has made reinforcement learning much more powerful, allowing it to beat world champion Go and chess players, achieve superhuman performance in video games, and even control robots in the physical world. Conversely, reinforcement learning has made deep neural networks much more powerful. The latest LLM technologies like ChatGPT, Claude, and Gemini use a technique known as reinforcement learning from human feedback to train these AIs to be our helpful assistants. In short, if you consider yourself a modern machine learning engineer, you need to know both deep learning and reinforcement learning and how to combine them. So what will you learn in this course and what will you get out of it? This course will teach you two fundamental approaches for how to combine deep learning with reinforcement learning. The first is deep Q learning or DQN, which stands for deep Q networks. Invented by leading AI company DeepMind, this was the first and most important discovery for learning how to apply deep neural networks in the field of reinforcement learning. It introduces various tricks, like sampling from a replay buffer, to improve performance. These tricks are what allowed these systems to achieve superhuman performance across a suite of Atari video games, including Breakout, Pong, and Space Invaders. They also led to a system that could beat the world champion in a strategy game called Go which experts at the time predicted was still a decade from being achievable. The second technique we'll learn about is called Advantage Actor Critic, or A2C. This method is also extremely important because it uses an entirely new approach to reinforcement learning, called the Policy Gradient Method. Unlike deep Q learning, this does not directly build on any method we previously learned about. More advanced techniques such as PPO, or Proximal Policy Optimization, are based on the same ideas. To illustrate just how powerful this is, OpenAI, who developed ChatGPT, uses PPO as its default reinforcement learning technique. It was also used to train ChatGPT. So learning about these two algorithms, DQN and A2C, will give you a strong foundation in deep reinforcement learning, and you'll understand all the fundamental ideas behind today's technology. And yes, because this is a lazy programmer course, you will learn how to build these algorithms from scratch and apply them to a variety of datasets. No longer will you have to spend 20 minutes just to learn one line of API code while still wondering how any of it works. By the end of this course, you will feel comfortable listing deep reinforcement learning on your resume. You'll also get a certificate of completion you can share in your LinkedIn account to impress your colleagues and potential employers with your newfound skills. This course will help you achieve your career goals. Whether you want to get a job in AI and machine learning, increase your salary, create your own business, or just analyze data for fun, this course is for you. Thanks for listening, and I'll see you in the next lecture.